We support artists of South Asian descent and we work with uh, a number of organisations to promote artists. We uh, programme professional development opportunities for artists, so artist surgery, consultancy, advice. We programme exhibitions, artist residencies, um, collaborate with museums, galleries, education institutions. Um, we deliver a number of publications and include um, a number of audience development initiatives as well. We have um, a number of uh, artists who have sought advice about their career path, about marketing, about their practice, and um, we've developed it in, in a more constructive way by having one-to-one -one sessions where we ask artists to fill in a questionnaire that asks them about their practice and um, information, images about their work and what area they want to develop. And so um, the one-to-one -one session is about focusing on that and their needs. One of the things that comes up is things about marketing, the lack of ability to be able to market their own work, um, fundraising, where can they find funds from and where do they get funds, profiling, exhibiting spaces, um, yeah, the lack of writing, people do want as much, you know, website development. Um, also, um, linking in with other networks to be able to sort of communicate ideas with other artists uh, as well, a support group if you like. We think there are very few South Asian role models within the arts actually. What we try and do is work quite closely with artists to be able to have that link. For example, in organisations and institutions where there's very little reflection of people of you know, country diverse backgrounds in really senior positions. If you see somebody from the same background as you or who's able to have achieved such a, a position or is able to achieve success, that's a motivator because it's about learning how to um, become quite business savvy as well as producing and that's the critical thing I think.